Hello, this is Nick with Nick's Computer Fix, and here's a video on how to download iTunes on Windows 11. And by the way, be sure to click on that subscribe button. It would be greatly appreciated. Okay, let's go ahead and get started here. First thing we want to go ahead and do is to go down and left click on our start menu button here. And once the start menu is open, you can see some pinned apps, and one of them is Microsoft Store. But if you don't see it, you can go over to the right hand side here and click on all and that gives you all of the apps and you can scroll down and find Microsoft Store. And once you do, go ahead and left click on that and that will open up the store. Once it's open, we can go up to the search line here up top and we can type in iTunes. Or if you see the selection of iTunes, you can just click on it and once you do, It'll go ahead and give us a selection of apps that can be installed on your computer. And the first one is iTunes. And it is free, so click on the free and you'll get the Git and then you'll get the install. So we go ahead and click on install here because uh, that's what we want to do. And then you'll see getting ready and sometimes you'll see it's waiting in queue. And most of the time, when it's in queue, it doesn't stay in the queue too long because the Microsoft Store is pretty fast. And then it's getting it ready and preparing to download. And then the download takes place. And then just a few moments later, we'll see the installation of the iTunes application. As you can see, it's given us a percentage of completion. And this can take a couple of minutes to complete um, the installation depending on the speed and performance of your computer and your Wi-Fi and internet service speed as well. Once it's completed, you'll see the um, icon that says open and you can go ahead and click on open. And when you do, you'll see the iTunes license agreement and you do want to go ahead and click on agree and then we can close out the Microsoft Store because we no longer need to have that open and a few seconds later the iTunes um, application is now open and on your desktop and we can click on agree here on this first display and um, the first thing that comes up after we click on agree is music and we can go to the store right now and it says welcome to iTunes Store and I'm going to just go ahead and click on continue. And now we have a selection of music from the iTunes store that we can listen to and download and play. All right, that's how you go about installing iTunes on Windows 11. So let me go ahead and close this out. And let me show you one other item. For your convenience, it's a lot easier to click on a desktop shortcut. Um, to get to the iTunes application versus going to the start menu. So let's make a shortcut on our Windows 11 desktop for iTunes. And we can do that by going down to our start menu and left clicking and then going up to the all apps little button here and left clicking and then scrolling down and locate iTunes. And once you do, just go ahead and left click, select it and drag and drop it onto your desktop just like you see here and now I have a shortcut on my desktop that I can locate anywhere on my desktop for iTunes so it makes it very convenient to open up iTunes quickly whenever I want to listen to some music thanks for watching and be sure to click on that subscribe button and leave a like if you like